Good morning, boys and girls, and welcome to Shen Plays. I'm your host, Shenner, and today we're back for some more Sunny Strike Back. This is episode 64 in our wonderful series with Majin and Quill18. Say hi, everybody. Hey, folks. Hey, everybody. We're still stuck in our coalition war against Britain, Sweden, and France, and friends. And mm -hmm. uh, yeah, uh, Mad was just noticing that Quill's over here colonizing the Spice Islands. Yeah, I, I didn't really notice it before, but when I switched to the player map, <laughs> it made it slightly more obvious. I need my chilies. Uh-huh. I'm just imagining your, the, the sultans over there. He's like, you know, all these wars are great, but sometimes I just want to put my feet up. Yep. Yeah. Need an island of my own. It's my vacation hotspot. Good times. All right, so let's see if we can try this again. Yeah, attempt number two here. Two weeks in a row, Quill desyncs right off the first day. Don't worry, don't worry. It's 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 going to be patched in the next uh, the next release, right? Yeah. Oh yeah, no, no, no more desyncs ever. Yeah, Perfect. ever, ever. Revolts in All Gabu. Right. All right, time to go kill some Swedes. See, this is why the paradox people keep making our games desync because you talk like that. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> It's not my fault that they made them hate me. Well, that's true. They did start the war. Yes. Well, England started the war, but what? Oh, we blame oh, the regency. Regency. <laughs> I was already in the regency. I went from regency <laughs> to regency. <laughs> Welcome to another regency. Hope you enjoy. <laughs> so I guess you can't declare any wars for us. No, not for six years. Kind of it's not, it's not that bad. bad. No. Yeah. Okay. And my air's not bad. A two three five, I'll take that. Get the military tech going. I wonder if I can dump a leader. No, not really, because I need my admiral. Uh bitey, bitey, bitey. Bitey is good. Oi, oi, oi. Oh, these Swedes. They don't even see it coming. I did not win versus Moscow. That makes me very sad. Okay. Maybe I'll send a stack up there to help push it. Um, but it's tough to hold a second. We're gonna have a little game. Oh no! That now they figured it out. What? Oh, that there's the Swedes are gonna die. Hey, I'm trying to. Hmm. Pausing helps. Goodbye, Swedes. Poof! Ten more score. <laughs> Enjoy. Mm. Sixty-nine. Wait, that's not very mature to point out. I like how Castile is sandwiching itself on Mercia between Granada and Aragon. Oh. It, it, it's got plans. <laughs> See, where am I going today? Hmm. There's no truce. Yeah. Although if he declares war, he's going to basically be declaring war. Well, not on his own. I guess Portugal would come in as well. Portugal, who's hmm. got a 27k stack right next to my 21k. Yeah, I'm a little worried all of a sudden. Mm, all of a sudden? Mm hmm With my zero manpower. Yeah, that's that's no fun. I do have some money, though. Uh, as soon as that cores, then I can merc. Although, oh, no, if that counts as overseas, I can't merc in Portugal. Oh, did you kill the Russians? Or your vassals did? Yeah, uh, I think Bohemia did it. Yeah, somebody's vassals did it. <laughs> How Finland many vassals do we have? What a team. <laughs> Um, so you got the whole Sweden thing covered, so that's great. I'm going to go for a wander. A walkabout? Yeah, we're going to do a bit of a walkabout. Um, yeah, Italy's kind of screwed, so whatever. Mm. <laughs> hey, as long as they're distracted. Yeah, pretty much. And that's the thing, if we do declare, or if Castile does declare against us, it's going to be busy grabbing all my stuff in Portugal and Aragon. Mm -hmm. It's like, okay. It buys us time to do real damage somewhere else. Mm, let's see if I can start this fight before... Oh, the stack that was in the cape may have gone. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. What? Ah! Okay, I was trying, I, This is why I pause a lot, because I was trying to move a general. And I didn't move the general in time. Oh, yeah. 
Looks like Great Britain to, decided uh, to land in Ca Cameroon. We're up to 71% already. All right. Even though France has sieged Lombardia, Liguria, and Brescia. Yeah, so but those are unimportant. Bad. Well, there are a lot of base tax. And the British enthusiasm down to medium now. Yeah, but keep in mind, it's a lot of base tax for a vassal of somebody who's not the war leader. Mm -hmm. I like how you're trying to logic it, as if the game actually uses logic to calculate <laughs> stuff. Well, sort of. All right, I got a 42 stack roaming around, smacking up. Oop. Integrated, integrated. Hold on, pause, pause, oh, pause, pause, goodbye, pause. Goodbye, Styria. Now you Styria. have to find out where the, where Get you got green. their armies. Naj is gone, and we now have Revolutionary War CB against Switzerland. Nice. And... Do you want to do it during this war? Or do you want to you want to break? And also Holy War against Alsace, Baden, Salzburg, Switzerland, Württemberg. So your people. idea is you want to annex Switzerland and then turn it into a vassal and then feed it back its course. There is a lot of Swiss cores that uh, Austria has. Yo. Oh, all of those, yeah. Yeah, lots. Um, they are allied with Salzburg, Savoy, and Tuscany. You can annex Savoy in that war. Uh, the problem is... Oh, yeah, I'm not... Well, yeah, I was going to say, the problem is that I'm at war with uh, crazy people, but no, I'm not. I forgot. not uh, actually at war with Austria. So... Um, if Savoy takes over the war, they pull in France, and that's just not cool. Because unless Austria takes over the war, at which point they pull in France, so that's still not cool. <laughs> well, France is already in the war, or in a war. <laughs> yeah, but then my point is we have to declare a war before. Yeah, bef mm -hmm. uh, before Austria gets to pull in everybody. <laughs> Would you guys like to see something cool? Okay. Head to the Pacific Ocean and check out the province Duren in Siberia. It's Castilian. <laughs> Click yes. on it. It's it's being it's invaded siege. by VJ. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> That's awesome. Vijayanagar in <laughs> Siberia. Nice. Um, cool. I, I take it Castile declared war on VJ trying to get into India? Yeah, and uh, VJ just said, screw it, I've got military access. He just yeah. walked all the way up there. Nice. Yeah. Uh, and they're all, of course, VJ is also fighting in the Mughals, so that's going to hurt them for a bit. I like the fact that you're adjacent to Castile. Yeah, that's why I didn't take that in the last war. Mm -hmm. That is actually kind of funny. All right, so Styrian armies. Apparently, they were up in Finland. Or at least, oh, and Naj. So, they're all up in Finland, in Muscovy. But you've got that covered, right? So, yep. bring you home, so I can figure out where that is. Um, let move this stuff. What else do we got? Because like, that's actually weird, because I was reasonably sure that integrations get paused while land is being sieged in a war. But apparently not. I think it only counts if it's their capital. Hmm. Okay. Is it, does it have to be fully sieged or just have a unit, an army on there? I don't remember. I think it was fully sieged. That had to be uh, had to be done. Oh, there's more over here. Apparently, my annexation somebody built of a ton of cav. Milan is doing nothing. <laughs> I, one of those two built a lot of cav, and we're just like following the Finns and the other guys around. Like, I'm not sure where they That's were going. Useful. But it was all Merc Cav. So, not useful. <laughs> get rid of that. Actually, I think i just get rid of all the Mercs that they have. Yeah. These guys murked up a little bit. I wonder why. <laughs> My vessel's like, we need units because our boss keeps telling us to go to war. They have no manpower. We don't get gazzy. Oh, Styria built a fleet. Weird. All right. Anyways, <laughs> moving on. I think that's all that stuff. Oh, and I'm getting call for peace for the Persian War. Mm-hmm. So... so you're going to have to start that other one soon. 
Yeah, like right about now. You're going to declare on the Moogles? No, no, declare on the Mamluks because the Moogles are in the coalition against me. Oh. Um, I oh, have... I thought the whole thing with the... Oh, oh, you can peace out now. You don't need that extra chunk of Persia. No, I do need to go get that Persian core, which means I have to declare war on the Moogles to actually go siege it. Right. But you said you're going to declare on the Mamluks. Who are allied to the Moogles. And the Moogles are big enough to take uh, over. There you go. I see. Uh, yeah, I'm not going to call anybody in individually. And the other reason to declare war on the Mughals right now is because Crimea is in the war against Persia. But they're also allied with the Mamluks. So that's another reason to do it now. Mm -hmm. All right, Morocco. Apparently you're going to say no. I'm pretty sure I'm going to say yes. <laughs> <laughs> it says you were close. Like, you were almost there. Uh, but apparently you were going to say no. All right, I guess I'll move my leader back to over here. And Welcome get getting G guided. All right, Jolov has a Regency Council, apparently. Bad Jolov. <laughs> and I'm losing a lot of money at the moment. Uh, all right, moving on. Oh no, Wurttemberg joined the coalition against me. Switzerland joined the coalition against me. <laughs> Timing is everything. <sighs> yeah, if I declared the war before all of that. I mean, it's just that I soaked in some yeah. of that stuff. Oh, so... right, it brought me in both the wars. It was like instant peace offer from Persia. Who? There's a Persia? I don't know. I'm pretty sure I've never been there. Yeah. Don't worry. Yeah, I'm going to stay in. It doesn't make a difference one way or another. They're tasty kibble in bits. Are you going to attack the troops in Cairo? Oh, I should probably do something over there, yeah. I was still looking in Europe. I thought you were going to take care of everything. <laughs> well, I just noticed you had troops there, so I'm like, I don't know. I guess I'm going to go venture out somewhere else. Well, I figured I'd put some troops there that, so that the Mamluks wouldn't, you know, just start sieging me. Mm. Oh, um, I guess we should discuss this, but I'm going to take Alexandria. I have a claim on it. Uh, so do I. But most importantly, the reason... I guess uh -huh. let's pause this before we start doing this so we can discuss this part because we didn't actually do that off camera. Uh, the reason I say that is because Alexandria Trade Node all points to me. doesn't point at you. So if you own a lot of that stuff, then you aren't... Uh, you're you're going to be messing with my trade, which I need to shove it all into uh, Constantinople. All right, fair enough. Anyway, I'll take so, some stuff on the, uh, the Gulf of Suez. Like, I'll... Yeah, yeah. And that, and then some um, other bits and pieces. So Dongla, Khazar, even uh, Suakin, that's all fine. Um, but yeah, I need the the core up there. All right. For, for trade purposes. You can have the south side, especially the coast, so that you can build ships down there for trade power. That's all good. All right, fine with me. No worries. Uh, okay, so we agree? Good. Mm -hmm. Off we go. Um, so I'm slipping in. Whoop. Kinky. Um, okay, actually, I'm going to just siege Cairo and Alexandria. You can take all the rest. Um, though I'm not sure how that all works out with respect to the uh, mission. How did, how so does what that is work your mission? Uh, take Egypt. Hmm. Mostly from the Mamluks. Where are you going? Where are you going there? Good news. I have pieced out Cleves. Yeah. Woo! Congratulations. Oh, you could have separate pieced out Cleves? Yeah, they're in the list of separate peaceable nations. Just like Brabant, uh, uh... Lorraine, and that's it. Oh, I didn't know we could get those guys, because I could have like just... I was over there. I was in Cleves. <laughs> I could have sieged it out. I thought we were, I thought they weren't possible. I could have sieged it out, and we could have just like annexed the whole area. Sorry, I didn't know we could have annexed the whole area. Weird, not being the war leader in a coalition war against somebody. Yeah, I can't believe people didn't declare war on you this time. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Austria's scared, man. Wait, how did I... 
Oh my god, it took that long for my troops to get there. To move from, like, Fez down to Cameroon, they had enough time to siege Cameroon. I guess it's probably a level 1 fort. Yeah. Alright, that makes sense. Alright, come on, plow right into Persia. It'd be really sweet if I got my vassals generals when they annexed. Mm, that would be oh, super don't. nice, but yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. No rebels. Oh, uh, Sweden has rebuilt a little bit of an army in Skåne. Oh, Thringa left the coalition against me. Why would anyone leave against you? Did they, would they really move to Kazan? Because I have mm. to assume it's not for lack of AE. Yeah, no. I Even my vassals down there hate me. So, <laughs> yeah. Guessing it's uh, something to do with something else. <laughs> something, something. Something, something. Yeah, I have a feeling I'm also going to go smack Oman around for a little bit. Just Ottoman things. Hashtag. Yeah, yeah just Ottoman things. <laughs> <laughs> Hashtag Ottomans kick your butt. Uh, no, I think Yemen still needs some cores back. I can soak them in. Uh, but yeah, I need some Venetian cores back so I can soak them in. So yeah, I guess we do need to go smack around uh, Austria, trigger my coalition. It'd be really nice if we could take like five years off. <laughs> it would be, wouldn't it? I'm sure the AI thinks that too, though. Oh, Brittany and France are going after my army in uh, Italy. Apparently that didn't work. Especially with the uh, the Dutch sitting on <laughs> sitting in the next province, like, yeah, you guys are fighting, having a little fight, but mm, whatever. Wow, we are actually getting a lot of war score here. Oh, goodbye, Oirai Horde. One sec. Cores. Get there. Did you just soak in the Oirai Horde? Oh, Maybe. you did. Look wow. at them go. Bye bye. That name they, getting so big. Yep. Th they converted a lot of land for me, which is the main reason I wanted them. Yeah, let's look at the religion map mode. That is very Sunni. Oh, look at you building a fleet. And look, you're just declaring a separate war anyways, even though he said something about... I need about... to do it right now before they coalition me. Oh. It's yeah. the perfect time. Japan's growing quite a bit, too. Wow. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they are kicking Manchu around. And Vaginagar successfully sieged up... Uh, what's her name? Cruz Castile over here. Yay, Coors! Where? In Portugal. Yeah, I've almost got my course. Oh, I've got four free diplomats. I should probably do something with those. Uh-oh. Call for peace with Britain. We're winning too much. Oh, I'm getting, like, claims everywhere, apparently. Weirdly. Uh, oof. Maybe we'll swing back over to negative piety for a bit. Get some tech. Oh my god. Shun. Shun just spawned out of rebels. They spawned with three military tech. Wow. Yeah. That happens. It's, it's one of those weirdnesses where the... Uh, They're not long um, for this world. Yeah, the Chinese groups that spawn out don't seem to do so properly on the uh, tech side. I 
I like beating up on Britain, though. This feels good. That is fun. I keep landing these teeny tiny little armies on my coast. Or oh, did they actually land that four stack in Portugal? No, they landed a four stack in Cameroon and then a five stack in Gabon. Just sacrificial lambs. One after another. Here, little lammy. So many rebels. Yeah, I'm working on that too. Where did France's name? Oh, that's still there. All right. Um, we can't get across to Jalen, can we? Uh, to where? Uh, Jalen, Denmark. Oh, yeah, we can. What are you talking about? Oh, Britain's Navy. It is in the wrong spot. <laughs> it's a little further up. Because yeah, we can't do this as do it walks across. across. Oh, usually they move instantly to block. No. Nope. Like, I'm not there now, but I will be in a second. Rawr. Got what the colony? Oh, the freaking rebels double spawned on my army. Oh no, the Oman. I, I went after rebels and apparently Oman decided to go help them. Jerks. You know it's bad when I'm like, yeah, I'm fighting the Mughals. Eh, whatever, I'll look somewhere else. <laughs> How's your They're really level? not that threatening? <laughs> Apparently not. Uh, apparently, we have fought. Um, they, they ran more units into mine than I had there, and they died all by themselves. They have no manpower. They still have 58k troops kicking around, but no manpower. Uh, do I... Oh, hold on, hold on. Ooh. Can I get a diplomatic insult on Austria? Or I can ease tensions with pretty much Europe. You get plus 60 with, I think, up to 15 people. Yeah. That's pretty strong. That actually might kick more people out of the... Uh, I'm going to do it. It might kick a few extras out of the uh, coalition against me. Or not, considering they're all at, like, negative 200. But, eh. It was there. Okay, maybe not. Go hate Shen more so I can kill you. It's a good plan. I didn't do anything wrong. <sighs> yay! Hold on, hold on. I keep pausing. But yay! Persia is finally... Ow. The vessel. Vassal? Oh, do it, yeah. Vassal, 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 vassal. Squeesh! And now you feed. Mmm, tasty feed. I'm just about <laughs> done all my sieges here. Just one more to go. Ooh. Taxes, taxes, taxes. Yeah, that war with Great Britain should probably end at some point. Oh no! You're losing some troops in Italy. Yes. Run away! Uh, so at the at some point should probably be really soon because the French are causing issues now. They're actually sending real units. Other than those fake ones. Paper tigers. Mm-hmm. Ninety six point eight OE is what you're gonna get. That's what I'm already at. Oh. So I don't know about this whole declaring on Castile thing here. Yeah, maybe we take a small break for Moors. Because part of the issue is just getting troops over there. 
because you're not going to be able to walk over land. Oh, no. No, no the robot's not done. Well, we'll discuss it right. over the break. We should pause. probably pause yeah, we'll, we'll, the game. Look, we'll look at these deals. <laughs> <laughs> probably pause the game after that. Maybe. All right. See you Bye, next everybody. time, folks. See ya. Hey, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe. Also, leave a comment. Did you know I read every single comment someone leaves on my video? That's insane. Why would I do that? I don't know, but I'll read yours.